part one of this tutorial, I have shown you how you could build 3D LEGO models using MLCAD and LEOCAD. As I promised, today I will show you how we can edit the models using LD Design Pad in order to smooth them. After that, we will generate PDF instructions for building our model using LPUB. Here we have the models we have built in episode 43. So I'll open LD Design Pad and load the first one. So actually the LDRAW file looks like this with many, many numbers. First we have uh, some model info and then we have several lines which all begin with one. This means that each line adds a uh, part to the model. The next number is the code for the color of these parts. In our case, they are all black. Then we have the X, Y and Z coordinates of the center. And here we have the matrix of rotation. Uh, last, we have the number of the part which we'll put on the model. So let's load the model in LD view. It looks like this. And as you can see, the upper part is uh, has a slight difference. So I'd like to move it a little bit in order to fit more precisely on the model. And also I'd like to change the colors of the parts in order to make the model look more real. Uh, first, I'll begin with changing the color. So the first part is Technic Beam, so it's uh, dark gray, so it will be 72. You can also find the code numbers here, you don't have to know them by heart. Next we have the Technic Pin Wong, which will be blue, so it's 1. Okay, and these two are the Technic Cross Blocks which are light gray, which is 71. And the last part is again Technic Beam, so it's 72. So save the model and load it again in LD view. Okay, so now as you can see the models are, the model has real colors and I have only to move this block here. The orientation of the block is right, so the only thing that I have to move is uh, its coordinates. So actually the first and the last block must almost match. The only difference must be in height. So as you can see, the first, the Higgs coordinate matches. So I'll match the Z coordinate and the Y coordinate I'll make it 40. Actually here one Lego distance, one Lego unit is uh, 20. So I have to skip two Lego units between the two parts which equals 40. So I'll save the model and load it in LD view. And now as you can see the parts fit perfectly. Next I would like to add steps in order to make a building instruction for this model. This is done by the command zero step. So I'll have a step after the first part, which is zero step. Okay. Then I'll add the four Technic long pins. Then I'll have another step. Then I'll add the Technic cross blocks and then I have the last step. So again, save the model and load it. And now I can go from the beginning and I have all of the steps. Great. So now I'll close uh, LD Design Pad and open LPUB. Here we will load my first model. And as you can see, there's automatically generated PDF 
which you could use for building instructions if you want to rebuild your model. This PDF can be saved from this button here. You give uh, an appropriate name, let's say my first model and save the model. So let's see how it looks like. Here is the PDF we have generated and as you can see the instructions are pretty nice. You could download all the files you have created in this tutorial under the material tab below this video.